Hey guys, and welcome back to another From the Depths episode. I'm Exterminator, and thanks for joining me. So, uh, yeah, last time we had that massive battle where I actually had to go in and uh, do a little dirty work myself um, to actually get it done uh, with my mini gun and all that. Uh, it was really a good example of when I might want the grenade launcher. Uh, so I think I might save up points for that. But uh, we spawned in our utility yacht here and um, repaired some stuff that got damaged and um, we did capture a vanguard and some people suggested which I think is a really good idea that I didn't think about is just scrap it it's a pretty crappy vessel and I'd rather have the resources for something else so I'm also going to scrap the Antalon so let's go ahead scrap the Antalon and let me see so 39,000 metal let me see how much I get from this Vanguard. 43, okay, not bad. Um, now, I was going to spawn in another one of the... Wow. <laughs> I'm not really sure. Okay, well, actually, while we're at it, let's um pull everything out of play. And which one am I on? Let's have you guys go this way and you go this way. Um, I was going to spawn in one of the, uh, what was it? What was I going to, I'm trying to think here. There's so many vehicles now people have submitted, which is really awesome. Um, well, first of all, forgive me if I butcher the name of the vehicles. Just, yeah, I'm not that great with names. Um, but, okay, oh yeah, it was the, the Aegis, I think is how you pronounce it. A E G I S Aegis Aegis. Um, I was gonna do the Mark III because I can't afford the Mark V, but the um, the creator said that um, where's the re okay here it is. The creator said that there might be some problems with the Mark III that he hadn't fixed until the Mark V. So I'd kind of rather use the Mark V, however, um, yeah. <laughs> however, I don't have the resources for that. So let's go ahead and, let's go ahead and play you. Because this has a vehicle spawner. I'm just wondering, is there a way for me to spawn in? Can I just like tell you to stop? Because I want to spawn in. Yeah, you're not gonna do that, huh? I want to spawn in one of the bases. Um. Oh, that's actually not gonna work. Okay, here's a better way to do it, I think. Um. Is temporarily there's probably a lot better way to do this. Um, <laughs> if someone has a su suggestion, definitely let me know. But uh. I think the easiest way right this minute would be to um, enter build mode here and just not on that, not on that, nope, just nope. I don't want to build on this vehicle. Um, new object, fortress. Screw you, man. I don't want to attach to you. Um, let's just pull all. Perhaps that will fix the issue. Okay, so I'm kind of still in the resource zone. Let me get over here a little bit. Oh, okay. Well, yeah, actually. I really just want somewhere to stand um, and put a whatchamathing. Uh, let's use... Um, that needs an engine. Let's just, uh, well, crap. I mean, can I, if I, like, jump up on this thing, which I built, this is just gonna, like, fall over. Screw you, man. So, load constructible. Okay, so can I just do that without a thingy? 
Okay, I think I might actually have to do that, or just make this a bit bigger. Um, I'm having some troubles. Okay, let's um, let's use a beam. Try to perhaps even this out. Now I'm upside down, but. Um, okay. Perhaps now I can actually get on it without it tipping over. I'd like to just load one of these starter bases that someone provided. You're just not going to let me do this without a turbine thing, are you? Okay, low constructible. Let's see what happens. Because I do want this resource zone. Um, YouTube submitted vehicles. Yeah, look at all these. And some of these actually don't really count because they're, um, I made a thread on the forums for people to make, um, our airship command center for later on. And a lot, some of these are ones people like had already and submitted that I've been testing out. <laughs> they are all really, really awesome, except most of them lag the game like horribly which probably is just something I'm gonna have to deal with um I forget which one it is I think it's starter um I think so so if I load starter that does nothing Or maybe it just did it load it like out of play. Air slicer, utility area, you go that way. Can I like click on vehicle? Okay, starter. Zero percent done. I see. Um, this is not working out how I wanted. So, um, let's just, um, let's just do a new object and do fortress structure just so I can like actually get this to work. Um, wood block and a wood beam. Nope, not a wood slope. No wonder that didn't work. I put all wood slopes there. <laughs> oh god, I'm just gonna need like a tiny little engine. I just want a sub vehicle spawner, is all I want. And, um, yeah, so do that. 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 And that. And then here. I really shouldn't need much more room than that. Okay, let's go to engines, engine block. This is going to be not an efficient engine whatsoever, but we will, um, that's, it literally needs like hardly any power whatsoever. I know mirror mode would be wonderful, probably a good idea, but, uh, right, connects that are connect crankshaft, yeah, okay, carburetor, yes, thank you, um, engine zone fuel tank. Attach these to carburetors. 
And let's just put a supercharger which attaches to carburetors as well. So this is a really terrible engine, but that's okay. And then, um, crap, was it the resources? Fuel storage tank, that's what I want. That should be good, that should hold him up. There should be more than enough power. Um, yeah, okay, so let's um, go up here. And uh, let's build and add miscellaneous, actually, yeah, sub-vehicle spawner. That's what I want, right? Why does this look different? Uh, no, I think this is what I want. Or not. Yeah, no, that's what's on the other thing. And then I just want repair tentacles, repair bot. Oh, wait, never mind. I don't want that. I want a vehicle blueprint spawner. And then I want repair tentacles. So that's actually probably what it's building right now. And then, um, crap, I might be in the way, I'll see. Okay, so one of these, vehicle, you need to go die. Um, <laughs> starter, okay, um, let's take a look at our fleets, okay, vehicle, which is this thing, scrap it, and that's about it, starter, and then this fortress, I'll get rid of as soon as this guy spawned in, I'm hoping this is what I actually want, because there were two, one of them someone submitted was a, um, like a replacement for your starting fortress, and then one was actually a fort, like a thing you put on resource zones, I'm not sure which this is, um, I have a bad feeling this is the one that replaces the starter fortress, maybe? I don't know why there's so many batteries and stuff. A little bit confused. And it's using up resources, but that's no big deal. We'll gather them here, and what's this? Okay. Repair bots. 66% done. Yeah, I think this is the one, to, uh, sir. Why are you moving? Maybe he's just positioning in the middle. Okay, so we do have all that. I think he's just positioning like in the middle because that's what they do, maybe. Um, there obviously must be an AI on this thing. Fortress control. I said Q. Okay, sweet. So we have this guy, he has two of those. One. Sweet. Okay, perfect. And if we look at this resource zone. Okay, so this one has tons of metal, which is actually great. Okay, so that's that. That's that. Starter, I want that one. Fortress. Okay, you. Okay, let's, um. Forces, fortress, scrap it, get those resources back, and of course I'm now left floating in the ocean, which is fine. Um, so I guess let's warp to the um, this guy, and let's head back, well actually 
I guess there's nothing that says we can't go find another battle. We do need more resources. Um, and I should still gather resources when these are out of play, shouldn't I? Let's see. It seems to be a little bit slower. It's in the air barge with us, and actually, let's um make sure there's nothing hiding down here. A lot of landmass. Definitely wouldn't mind building something on the land. And if we have a battle over, do wow, yeah. See, I do not want. I want you to come to me, preferably. I really don't want this battle. Try to veer, like, over here. Strength 40. Oh, no. It's one of those again. <laughs> oh, God. I have a bad feeling, guys. <laughs> oh, man, I have a very bad feeling. Um, I think... I actually want to go over here, and I may want to... Yeah. I think... What I'm going to do... Is... I'm going to spawn... Okay, so this guy has... Tractor beam. Crystal generator. Wow. Very nice. Seeing if you have an actual blueprint spawner. It looks like you do. Perfect, this is awesome. What? No, go away. Okay, so... I guess that's not actually what I wanted. Okay, yeah, that's not what I wanted. Okay. Let's um, do a different one. I want vehicle blueprint spawner. And you, I guess can go hmm. I guess you can go there there's not one already on here is there no it's different okay um I think I need to spawn something else in before <laughs> before I get too crazy okay um spawn point distance I think I wanted that like far hold for this time um. this is useful to stop built an enemy ship replicating forever what hold unit until 99% and hold for this time okay so yeah I well I actually can afford the mark 3 it's just there's some problems I think that I may not want to deal with so I might just want to wait for this one but let me see what else I have <laughs> yeah not that not that we have our a Phoenix which someone submitted we have a Ragjet, Ragjet Mark II, a Rogue Fish, which is actually a submarine, which might not be a bad addition, so we don't have all air vehicles. Spire, which is epic, but that's, yeah, <laughs> not for right now. Um, we do have our standard fleet submarine, which we can't actually afford. Um, and then there were a few things that were submitted from the uh, Steam Workshop. The, uh, <laughs> we have a anti-fortress artillery, like, it's like a plat a floating platform with just a massive gun on it, which I think is pretty damn cool. Um, I don't think I want to use that right this minute. It is a really cool idea, though, and I think I will use it at some point. Um... Come on, I know there were medium fighter. That sounds familiar. There was a um trying to find it, there was like a little helicopter. 
I don't remember what it was called. Heli airship? Well, no, that's not it. That's way too expensive. Crap. Um, let's actually give this, uh, let's see what this Ragjet is. Ragjet. Or a rogue fish. Actually, the rogue fish submarine might not be a bad idea. Let's give it a whirl. And if, and since it's not that expensive, um, I think, what? I thought it, like, blew up instantly. I was like, what? <laughs> I don't know why there's these batteries. I guess just to charge. Okay, so hold distance. Okay. Well, hold distance is about as far out as I can get it. Ah, oh, shit. I think I messed something up by doing that. You're supposed to hold it, man. Screw you. Okay. Um. Yeah, let's warp to this. There we go. Yeah, I messed something up by hitting that. Whoopsie. But yeah, a little submarine actually would be great. So, there's turret. I'm trying to see. Okay, nice. So, some missiles. I assume this is going to be on this side, too. Wow, so actually pretty inexpensive for what it offers. Um, let's take a look at these missiles. So, these are actually missiles and not torpedoes. So, they can target air and land stuff, which is pretty awesome. Very nice. And I assume we're done? Nice, okay. Um, Roguefish, let's see. Leave fleet. And then I want... Um, which one is the home sweet home? Is it? Yeah, okay. So I want to merge you and you no that's not actually what i wanted oh come on i've done this before man start merge i don't like that what stop it I don't want to merge those two together. I want to merge these two together. Oh, too distant. Derp. Um, okay, let's bring you guys this way. Interesting. So you can't move, you can't merge fleets unless they're really close together. That's kind of interesting. Um, I don't even know if we'll be able to fight this episode. I don't think so, which is unfortunate. Uh, okay, now we should be able to do this. Okay. I want you and you to merge. Sweet. And, I mean, we could spawn in yet something else if we really wanted to. Could try this rag jet. Um. Oh, this little submarine, along with our other stuff, might be able to take on whatever that thing, whatever those enemies were, they were like seven of them with a force count of 40, which is a little bit frightening. Are you not even on this resource zone? You idiot. Oh, that might help. <laughs> and yeah, okay, so I mean, we are gathering resources or not? Did you seriously deplete this resource zone already? 
No, there's metal there. Are you just... Why are you not working? What's going on? Okay, well, let's drop you off. So, maybe that's... Okay, there we go. Kind of. Is that actually not a submarine? <laughs> I think it's supposed to be a submarine. Um... This looks like it should be a submarine. Okay, there we go. Just don't hit stuff, alright? What is your AI set at? Oh. There we go. I think I had the weapons controlled so he couldn't do, like, anything. But, um... Let's see. Why are you not... Okay. Um... Superchargers? No, I want... Hmm. I think he should be... I don't know. I think stuff is, like, glitching out or something, because this guy's not even working, and he should be. Well, we're gaining oil. We should be gaining metal. Hmm. It's a little strange. And this, I think, should be a submarine. I think that's what I read. If not, that's no big deal, but I think it should be a submarine. And now you're moving backwards. Okay, then. Yeah, I'm going to call this an episode. Um, it seems like some things are not quite working out how they should be. Um, yeah. <laughs> I'm just confused. But I think that's going to be it this time, guys. Next time we will uh, fight the enemies over this way. And uh, take them out. And then maybe then we'll have the resources to spawn in. Um, one of the ag aguses. But, uh, but yeah, I think that's going to be it. So, as always, thanks so much for watching. I really appreciate it. I do hope you enjoyed. But until next time, I look forward to seeing you and take care.